Hi viewers, this is another Fix It Yourself project. So this is a Wolf microwave which was not heating and the fan was just turning on but the microwave is not heating properly. So one of the thing I diagnosed is the sensor. So they have these door sensors, uh, one here, right here. Some of them are always open and some of them are always closed. So once your microwave is, uh, this door is closed, the system senses if all the sensors are in their desirable state and then only the Megatron, the, uh, the heater component, it's gonna heat your food. But if any of these sensors are malfunctioning, it's not gonna heat up the food. So all you have to check if when you open and close the door, if the sensor changes their uh, post and how you can test that is using the multimeter just check the resistance on it you see how the setup is just check the resistance between these two ports one and there's one at the bottom so if the when you close the door or open the door if the continuity changes that means it's working good so the most faulty sensor this is the second time I'm changing on it uh, is comes out to be this one it's on the left side the right side has the same setup but it always works it's the left side this is the second time I'm changing the left side so you will see it kind of sensor goes faulty so what happens when this door we close this door uh, this is the object it kind of peers through this thing and tries to push this thing let me try to see if I can do it with the hand or maybe with the screwdriver so it pushes this uh, thing up and you will hear a click sound but you see how much hard I have to push this for that click to happen so when that clicks happen this is a always open sensor when that click happens it becomes closed and that's when the system senses that all the the sensor is working fine or the switch uh, so over time the switches goes bad and you see it's not functioning very well so what you do is just buy same replacement sensor uh, from Amazon or eBay and all you have to do is replace that replacement part is pretty easy take off these two wires and then this just sensor comes or the switch comes out pop in new switch and push back the wires uh, sorry I forgot to mention to access the door panel uh, it's gonna be pretty easy so I'll show you how this was placed in my kitchen so this microwave was in this area so it's a drawer microwave it was just right there I pulled it out and we put it here and then all you have to do is unscrew these panels from here and there you go the panel comes out you don't have to take the entire thing apart uh, just start with the left side if left side is all good then probably go on the right side we have the same sensor set up on the right side too but yeah unscrew one two three here and then a couple of uh, bolts here and couple down there and uh, this was like that of course you have to take this out too but anyways these are the two pieces I took out and after that you have access to those door switches replace it and it should be good to go thank you viewers if you have any questions post it in the comments and if you if this video helps you like the video and share it thank you so much bye bye